Hello my friends, today I would like to talk about angels. Angels are one of the most well-known beings of heaven for human mankind. All religions talk about angels. Uh, we are educated that angels protect us during our childhood, during our sleep, that we have angels protecting us through our lives. So they a pretty common knowledge. It is very astonishing that most of us don't talk to angels, don't see angels, don't communicate with them, even as they are around everybody. So, what are angels? Angels are messengers from heaven. And there is not only one heaven, there are plenty, many heavens and all heavens have their different angels. So there are heavens of communications and angels coming from these heavens are more communication angels and there are heavens of structure and these angels carry more structure. All of these angels are ready to connect because they are messengers that they have to connect. It is their art of being, being connected being in communication. So everybody who wants to can say, hey, is there any angel around? Come, show up. And you make the experience that they show up. And they might show up in person, incarnated as a human being, as there are millions of angels incarnated right now to prepare the golden age. Or they may shine, show up in their light body. And they are so bright as you can stand it. It is not their brightness you can see, it's the brightness you are trained to see. So many of us are not trained to see light. And light can be so bright that it's more than we can take. So the angels are mostly friendly. They show up only at an amount of light that we can stand. And as we get used to this amount of light, they show up again and they are brighter, and they show up again and they are brighter and brighter and brighter. And in this communication with them, we may find out that we have our own light, that we are bright ourselves, that we can let our light shine too. As different as angels are, so different is the aura of angels. There are some angels who have butterfly-like lights in the back. But people thought our wings, they don't need wings, but it's a way of spreading the light. Some of these butterfly-like wings are so big that they are larger than your house. They're so large that they can cover a pretty big area. And they have signs in this aura signs of their universe, signs of their heaven. They are many colored. And these colors talk about their origin. And there are some who choose to find human form because they want to go to a karmic way of taking relations because they see how rich the experience as humans are. And there are some who never take this chance being a human but stay in their heavenly angel family and they don't go through incarnations they don't go through polarity they stay in their heaven being messengers of their heaven and being messengers of love anyway whatever these angels are it's always worse to connect to them it's always worse to make them part of your daily life go back and Remember the prayers you had as a child, talking to angels, inviting them to join you in your daily duties. And they will do, and it will enrich your experience of your own human life. Enjoy it. See you soon.